Y'all doing too much, Sharon. Where you at? Hey, Sharon. Doing too hey, much, bro. man. You come in here looking like the pro bowler. You doing too you much, man. You come in here looking like a baller. What's too up, much. man? What's up with you? Everything being played. Cool. Coming out the uh, from the Pro Bowl. It was cold. Man. We in time for Super Bowl. What you got? <sighs> can't count Tom Brady out, man. You said you can't count him out. Nah. But you still ain't told me nothing, though. That's that's. <laughs> But before I start cutting, you let me know what you want to do. You just line me up, man. I'm trying to get it to grow all the way back down this way. Okay. So you just keep that. Sponge in the top. Yeah. Shadow temp, ball temp. Shadow. Arch or no arch? Arch if you can do it. I don't know your skills. It's been what? About half a year Not already? A good year, man. Don't test my skills like that. What about you now? This, how long is this going on? Been open since April. Um, oh, you coming on your first year mark, huh? Coming on the first year mark, you know, Metro booming around here. Everything's, uh, everything's superb. Everything picking up. Me and you got a little history on the ping pong table in yeah. your house. You know, <laughs> you know, you got skill. I'm undefeated against you. I you let you skills. win. It was, it was, it was, it was, uh, you was new to the house. Okay, okay. So tell me about the season. How I go for you? Uh, I mean, it wasn't the best, but. Okay. I think it was more of a learning experience, so just overall, um, just really those type of seasons where you thought like you you had things going, and then like you know it all, and then next thing you know you're getting taught a lesson. So mm -hmm. I think it was more one of those, and knowing that you got to be a student of it. Being a pillar in the defense, what's something that you're gonna communicate with the guys throughout throughout the off season to prepare you for the season? Well, first I gotta. Communicate more. I mean, I'm not really a guy who's. But much of you in here talking and you don't, you ain't vocal. A raw, raw type of guy. But you got different type of settings, though, you know what I'm saying? Just being more vocal. Leading by example and really just, you know what I'm saying, tell them at the beginning what's at stake. Mm -hmm. I think for us, as a as a defense, we had like Thomas Davis, a guy who was like very vocal and, and led by example as well. So that's one of the things that's going to be missing in that locker room, and we need to replace that. But you know what, though? The great thing about being the leader, it really don't look a certain kind of way. You got a lot of style for a big guy, though, so um, you got a stylist. You, <laughs> you dress yourself or do somebody else dress you? During the season, yeah, I got to dress. I got a stylist. You got a stylist? Yeah. What about off season? Nah, that's all me. There you go. Ain't no fun. You know you big, man. I ain't as strong as you used to be, man. What's the what's the message that you try to get across to the kids? Well, just a lot of kids in East Chicago in general. Like I was one of those guys that never left East Chicago, and Purdue was only what an hour and fifteen uh -huh. away. And when I got the opportunity to go down there and visit, it was just like a whole totally like eye opener, like a whole different experience. Because you use what you used to from you know being in the hood where you're from. Mm -hmm. It's like you know, violence and, and all that is what you know. So, take the kids down there, we go to the classroom, we have like an escort to, you know, show us what's what's important about Purdue, what it's all about. Then we get to go toward like the sports side of it. It was just a fact, just trying to tell these kids like, look, I've been this way, I went this route. This is not the route to go. Like, it's gonna be hard to get out. I got out the grace of God. I did everything I had to do. You know, it was a support system and everything, but you guys can, go this way, which is a lot more easier than the route that you, you know what I'm saying, took. So, and I was like, okay, well maybe my gift is to help kids and help your younger generation come up to be successful. So, it's kind of where I'm at right now. Okay. I've been out of there a little bit. You ready? Mm, mm, mm. Practice made perfect, boy. That's what we learned, boy. Practice <laughs> made perfect. Appreciate it, man. Man, appreciate you, brother.